What's up, Warriors? How you guys doing? Today, we're going to talk about self-criticism. How that shit is so fucking helpful when you fucking criticize yourself because uh, that's what we need, you know? We need to criticize ourselves to become better, to fucking be more positive, to go after our goals, to go after what we fucking want, you know, because nobody's going to do it. You know, a lot of people right now, you know, they're, they're already tapping out. You know, they're talking about the holidays are coming and, you know, they don't know if they should join the program. They don't know if they should start their journey. You know, why are you going to wait for? Why do you think that you, you know, your day is going to be fucking any better than fucking uh, New Year's? You know, you got to start now. You got to fucking go hard on yourself. You know, my best transformation I did on the fucking holidays, throughout the holidays. You know, and why? You know, it happened to land, you know, when the holidays were here and I wasn't going to crack. I was already two months into it and, you know, I was just tired of always failing, always every year that uh, I set myself to, uh, you know, wanting a six pack, wanting a, a certain look, always fail, you know, and the same fucking story fucking uh, every fucking year, you know, come summer, you didn't get the results, you let off the gas, you start fucking just giving up. You know, and the excuse is that the holidays are here. It's going to be a lot more difficult. It's going to be a lot more pressure. And that's what you want. You know, you should challenge yourself. You should fucking see what you're made of. You know, that's why I fucking, you know, I I had enough of myself already by always failing every fucking year, telling my kids and my lady that I was going to become this fucking badass transformation. And fucking, it was just a bunch of fucking hot air and a bunch of fucking just bullshit fucking lies because uh, I never fucking uh, made it happen, you know, but after fucking just knowing that every year I was a failure, I was, that's it, you know, I have to fucking put my foot down, you know, be my, you know, uh, worst critic and uh, call myself out, call myself out on my bullshit, call myself out on what I was failing at because that's what we are, you know, we consider ourselves hard men, we consider ourselves badass motherfuckers, so show it. Show them, show yourself that, you know, you're about it, that you just don't talk about it. You know, don't make the fucking holidays an excuse. You know, I know that shit's gonna be fucking more pressure and it's gonna be more difficult, but it doesn't have to be like that. You have to fucking change your mindset, change the way that you think about, you know, how you uh, pursue the results that you want. You know, call yourself out, you know, be your, uh, you know, worst critic, you know, call yourself, you know, that, Tell yourself that, you know, you're going to be that fucking badass motherfucker regardless of what comes your way. That's going to be a challenge for you. You know, don't fucking cut yourself short. Don't fucking think that you're promised fucking, you know, a month from now, fucking three months from now that, you know, that it's going to be the perfect time for you to fucking smash your goals. Most of the time, something happens, something fucking falls on your lap and you end up fucking up on the New Year's anyways, which a lot of people do. And it becomes just a... Uh, Always just a bunch of fucking, uh, uh, you know, just a bunch of fucking hot air, a bunch of fucking uh, smoke that you talk to uh, everybody. Everybody knows that you're bullshitting. Everybody knows that you don't follow through. You know, why would you want to fucking be labeled as that person that always talks about it and never bees about it? Fuck that shit. You got to run that fucker in. It's not going to change. It's not going to get any better. By the time the New Year is here, you're going to kick yourself in the ass. You know, you're going to fucking wish that you would have started when you were thinking about it, when you were fucking procrastinating, when it was your conscious was telling you every morning, start now, let's go, let's do this. You know, you got to fucking just go after it, you know, because, you know, the thing is that, you know, excuses are always going to fucking be there. We're fucking such good liars that you're going to talk. The more you think about it, the, the, the easier chance that you're going to talk yourself out of it. Because that's what happens. A lot of people just make a bunch of excuses. They fucking, uh, they're valid, you know, according to them. And uh, they just, they run it. They run it and that's going to be their excuse that they tell uh, people, you know. And people, you know, me, I read, you know, I could fucking read right through you. You know, it's just a bunch of bullshit. Uh, a lot of my clients, I don't give them no way out because I know that those excuses, I used them before and uh, it doesn't get you nowhere. You know, this is life. Life's going to fucking uh, come knocking on the door and, uh, you know, it's going to test you. It's going to test you and see if you're about it. See if you're still going to fucking uh, wake up and uh, go after your goals, go after the results that you want. That's all a test. You know, 
I seen it and I fucking went through it, you know, so I wasn't stopping, you know, I fucking called myself out. I said I was going to fucking do it and I pulled it off, you know, and that's when I got my best transformation in 2020 where I was just tired and sick of myself that, you know, if you want to become that fucking solid man, that solid individual for your family, uphold your word, like you talk about, like you were ingrained since you were a youngster that... You, you know, your word is all you got, then fucking be about it. Show us what you are. Show us what you're made of. Don't just talk about it or, or uh, you know, think that, you know, by you, you know, uh, standing on your strength that, you know, that's going to be enough for you to, you know, have respect for self. Fuck that shit. Level up in all areas. That's what I'm fucking doing. We ain't stopping. You know, like I said, we don't got reverse. We got to keep pushing forward. And it's all in the fucking mind, you know. It's your fucking mindset that you have to shift shift the mindset into a, a positive mindset. Your perspective in life. See it as, you know, a challenge. You know, those habits that you have, those bad habits, just trade them for fucking good habits. It's going to be difficult. It's going to be uncomfortable. Because habits is something that you've been doing for a long time, whether good or bad. So once you fucking break it, or once you start fucking... Uh, moving out of those daily habits that you had, which it was just, uh, you know, a lot of fucking bullshit excuses, a lot of comfort, then of course it's going to be, it's going to feel a little bit discomfort. You know, that's what it's all about. You have to break those fucking bad habits and, you know, just fuck trade them for good habits, you know, get those fucking wheels turning. And like I said, if you don't know what you're doing, there's plenty of uh, information out there. There's plenty of coaches out there that could help you get the results so you won't be guessing. You know, why would you wanna to go to a destination without a map? You're gonna get frustrated, you're gonna get pissed off, and you're gonna fucking quit. Or it's gonna take you fucking 10 times longer to fucking get there. When you have a map, when you have a program, when you have a blueprint, it's a lot easier. You know there's, you know, that light on the, you know, in the other side of the fucking tunnel. You know there's fucking light there. You know that, you know, that destination, you're not gonna fucking, uh, you know, be stuck and be frustrated because you have somebody guiding you. So let's see what you made of. Let's fucking go.